Hey all, this is the Ruckus Feature Explainer Series. Uh, today we're going to talk about a new DHCP feature that was added to 8061 and it is the ability to statically map a IP address out of the DHCP pool to a MAC address. So um, what I'm going to do is with my laptop plugged in we will give it a specific IP address that is going to when it sends an I, uh, DHCP request the pool will give it that specific IP always um, so the first thing we'll do is this is uh, 80, 80.6.1 switch code um, on, a, uh, on a 7150 so what we're gonna do is we'll create our DHCP pool well for, first thing I'll enable DHCP server so IP DHCP server enable to turn on the DHCP server. Uh, then I'll create a pool. So IP DHCP server pool. Uh, give it a name. We'll just call it demo. Uh, we assign a network to it. So 10.0.0.0 with a class C subnet. And then the last thing I'm going to do is deploy it. So what's going to happen is the when a, when a device plugs in, it's going to be given the first address of the pool, 10001, and then the next one's 10002, etc. But what I want to do is assign it a specific MAC address to a specific IP. So uh, show IP DHCP server summary shows me that I have uh, one active lease, one pool. If I look at the binding database, uh, I have 10001 bound, uh, and you can see there's a, a default lease expiry of 24 hours um, with a type of automatic. Uh, but what I want to do, if I do a uh, show Mac, here's my laptop here plugged into 1.1.1 slash 1 slash 1. Um, and so what I want to do is bind this to a particular address. So we'll say 100050, we're going to bind this to. And so. Um, if I go back to my pool, IP DHCP server pool demo, um, then the new command is going to be uh, the static map IP, uh, static Mac IP mapping command. Uh, so we just do that static dash Mac dash IP dash mapping. Uh, then the next thing it wants is the IP, so we'll map it to 10.0.0.50, and then the um, the MAC address. And then I need to redeploy my pool. So show IP DHCP dash uh, server summary again, right? So I still have a deployed pool. I have an active lease. So show IP DHCP dash server binding will tell me that 100050 is bound, and you see there's no lease expiry time because it's a it's a static. Um, so on my laptop. If I release and renew, I should be given 10.0.0.50 out of the pool. So scroll up to my Ethernet adapter, and there it is, 10050. Um, and so Obviously, I don't have any other options. I'm not giving it a gateway or a TFTP server or anything. So, um, but now from here, I should be able to ping 10.0.0.5, .0 .0 not 5, 50. There we go. So easy as that. So you can put in multiple static IP mappings and do it that way. All right. So that's it for today. Thanks for joining. Have a great day.